Hey ninjas, what is going on? Chris Wachowski here, and today I'm gonna be walking you through the Gauntlets FAQ. So what exactly is the Gauntlet? The Gauntlet is a series of pro and amateur competitions that the NNL is gonna be hosting this spring outside in New Jersey at our huge outdoor mega course. Now this course is incredible. Uh, the construction has already started for it and uh, what's happening right now is we're digging a massive 250 foot trench through the middle of where we're going to be putting our truss, uh, which is essentially going to be a 7 foot deep to as deep as 15 foot uh, waterway, uh, river essentially, uh, that all of our obstacles are going to be hanging over. So the course itself is incredibly exciting and we've been getting a lot of questions about you know who designed this course and the design team uh, is consisting of ninjas that have been doing this for over 50 plus years. Guys that have been uh, building obstacles, designing obstacles, competing on obstacles uh, for well over 50 years. And uh, the entire team's kind of uh, motive or uh, philosophy, if you will, is focused around the kind of traditional stage one through stage four sense. Uh, and you'll see that in the course design when we reveal it. Uh, it's going to be, uh, you know, starting with some of the stage one stuff, moving into some of the stage two, building up to the stage three, and then culminating with a tower type climb with the stage four stuff. Uh, and we think that ninjas are really gonna love it because it kind of takes all those different elements and compacts it into one unbelievable course. So, the course itself is going to be uh, an interesting part of the format. Uh, so all of the competitions are going to follow the same format. The format is going to be pretty simple. Athletes will get two opportunities to post their fastest time. Uh, they'll be more or less running independently on the course. They'll be like a little bit of a stagger start. Uh, but uh, essentially it's like a time trial. And then what we'll do is we'll take the top eight times and then funnel them into a single elimination tournament where athletes will then get the opportunity to race head to head running at the same time. Now, jumping back to the format, there's another element about it, the course element, uh, that makes this event a little more exciting, a little bit different. So the whole idea is testing viable pro options, and one of the things that we want to test out is what happens if we share the course ahead of time? What happens if we let ninjas practice the course? Um, and we think the result's going to be awesome, both for course designers and for ninjas. It's going to allow us to throw some more challenging elements in there uh, that can be a little bit more difficult, and it's going to allow ninjas and athletes the opportunity to practice this stuff ahead of time. So we're going to be doing a full course launch video in the coming weeks, so definitely make sure that you subscribe, that you uh, are following our email, that you're following our social media so that you don't miss that. Uh, because you're definitely going to want to see how awesome this course is and you're definitely going to want to practice it because uh, even with practicing this uh, this course is going to be a little bit of a doozy it's going to be a tough one now moving on to the uh the different events i know i said we uh, i, I kind of went through the format uh, but we have a lot of different events that are surrounding this and it's easy to get the uh the different events kind of uh, jumbled together uh, so i'm going to do my best to kind of separate each one of them and show you uh who they're for and kind of how they work so the first event that I want to go through is the amateur event. The amateur event takes place May 22nd and May 23rd. These competitions are going to be for athletes that are ages 13 and up. These athletes will be given two opportunities to post their fastest time and then from there we'll take the top eight and funnel them into a head-to-head -head single elimination challenge. Age groups competing this weekend will include teen, young adult, adult, and masters. Each division will have its own tournament with its own final head-to-head -head elimination challenge. Now, if you're on the younger side of the NNL's age groups uh, and you're in that like uh, 12 and under range, uh, we do have stuff coming down the pipeline for you guys. Not quite yet, but uh, definitely keep a lookout because we're going to be sharing that soon. Now, moving on, it's actually easiest to skip ahead to our last event and then kind of work our way backwards. So our last event is going to be the Pro Obstacle Challenge. And with that event, we're going to be having a production crew come, we're going to be having interviews, uh, we're going to be focusing on the top eight athletes from our close qualifier, and we're going to be essentially putting together a pilot episode of what this looks like as a professional sporting event 
um, to kind of test feasibility. Uh, this one we're obviously very excited about it because if successful it has a lot of opportunities for ninjas to highlight their brand, uh, for them to become professional athletes and to uh, really elevate the sport to another level. Um, so obviously we are very excited about that and sim similarly the, the top eight here uh, will actually be uh, coming from a speed trial uh, which is going to be our close qualifier. The close qualifier will take place on June 1st and 2nd. This event will be invite only for any athlete that's qualified for the NNL Season 6 World Championships Elite Division. These athletes will get two opportunities to post the fastest time on their course and then the top eight will then move on to the pro event, which will be taking place June 5th, immediately following Goliathon. Uh, moving on to our open qualifier. Uh, so this is the last in our series of events, and this is actually gonna be the same weekend as our amateur stuff. So our open qualifier is gonna be May 23rd, and this is an opportunity for athletes to qualify to the closed qualifier if they aren't qualified for the NNL World's Season 6 Elite Division. So this competition is gonna be for athletes that are age 15 and up. Uh, they will be given two opportunities to post their fastest time on the course, and then the top eight from there will move on into a head-to-head -head single elimination tournament. Uh, and out of that, uh, top eight, we're going to take the top three and qualify them to the closed qualifier. Speaking of athletes eligible for our closed qualifier, they will also be eligible for our open qualifier. Since we're revealing the course ahead of time and we are encouraging athletes to practice the course, athletes that are planning to attend the closed qualifier can also come and compete during the May 23rd's open qualifier. If an athlete already invited to the close qualifier places in the top three, the spot will bump down to the next eligible athlete. So, uh, hopefully that cleared up a lot of questions that people have uh, about the gauntlet. Um, we know that there's a lot going on with it. We know there's a lot of events, a lot of new information. Um, so if you have questions about it, hit us up on Instagram, um, send us a tweet, uh, send us an email. We'll be happy to answer any questions. Uh, but definitely we are super excited for this course. We think that everybody's going to love it. Uh, don't forget to subscribe uh, to check out and see the course video. That will hopefully be coming in the next week. Uh, but other than that, that's all that I got for you guys today. Uh, so with that being said, I'll see you guys over at the gauntlet.